Hi guys, so in this video I'm going to be sharing with you what I purchased from Sephora Skincare, new luxury skincare. If you're interested in that content, then please keep watching. For sensitive skin, please keep watching. So the reality is, I don't know if it's for sensitive skin, but that's what I asked the um, person, he person helping me at Sephora, what products are for sensitive skin, acne prone skin, but I wanna just amp it up and I don't want to use uh, drugstore products. So this is my Sephora bag. And I got these a little bit before uh, Thanksgiving so a little bit well not a little bit over a month it's just been like a, a few weeks or a couple of weeks because we are uh, in December today is December the first and so let's just get right in it um, the first thing she told me to get or that was for a sensitive skin. And I feel like, if I'm not mistaken, it's a clean product. I don't know, gentle. It's a gentle product. Um, and it's Asian based, created, whatever the term. Um, Tatcha, Tatcha, so, um, she told me that it was probably best to get like the trial sizes. So you can see them in some sections in Sephora or you can see them at the checkout aisle. Like it's a, lo a little section um, when you're waiting to check out and they have a bunch of different trial sizes. And so this is regular $35, $35 but I got it for $27 and it's two products. Um, they're, I was about to say skinty, they're small. And I've already opened them, um, but this is the first product and it's a water cream, so a moisturizer, so to speak. And then I got the Deep Cleanse and um, it's a balancing and exfoliating cleanser. Now, this says it's for clarifying, clarifying cleanse and hydrate. The Deep Cleanse, so this is what you go in with first. A gentle exfoliating and clarifying cleanser of loofah fruit and wild rose that lifts dirt and refines pores without stripping skin. Apply to wet face, avoid eyes and rinse. And then the water cream is a light pore refining cream of wild rose and leopard lily that bursts to release Refreshing hydration for smooth, balanced skin. Massage a pearl size amount onto face, neck, decolletage in upward strokes morning and night. I've seen this before, um, but I didn't know, you know, I didn't know. I would try other things as well, just, you know, thinking about it. Um, anyway, so, I have tried it for the last couple of weeks. I started off trying it or using it every day um, for like three days straight. And I don't know if because my skin is oily and this is moisturizing, I would get like a breakout here and there. And so um, not saying that that's because of the products because I actually love this. It's, I don't know. I don't want to take it out but if you can see it and it has little micro beads in it so it's clear has little micro beads it's a gentle exfoliator and so when it says deep clean it cleans but it's moisturizing to my skin um it's moisturizing like as moisturizing as a cleanser can be. Like I don't feel like my skin is stripped. And so when they talk about like combination skin or oily skin, they say you don't want your face to be stripped because if it strips your face, then your face will produce more oils. So I hear. So 
I'm gonna try this more, but I'm gonna try it instead of like every day, like every other day. And I found that that works. I don't have any breakouts, like visible hurting breakouts. Like my skin has texture and I'm trying to combat that, you know, like just regular texture or like pores or you know what I mean so I'm trying to amp up my skincare um Lady Jim gave me a huge list of like luxury skin care so shout out to you girl because I need to go through that as well but for some reason I just went into um yeah this is made in Japan some um one day I just went into Sephora and was like what can I get just right now because I was just tired of the drugstore products at the moment um and then this water cream you definitely a little goes a long way with it it's just a bit in here it's not a lot at all but i feel like um if you just dot it on your hand it it's um concentrated so you can smooth it over your entire face with one blot of your finger and you wouldn't think that but um these are high quality products i'm gonna leave the price of the big jar on the screen and the big container of this on the screen you'll be surprised but it's great ingredients i mean i just i don't know so the jury's still out about tasha 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 i want to love it you know because i love japanese skincare um what i've tried from like tj maxx and stuff like that like they have the aloe and um or asian type skincare um skin flawless do you hear me um so yeah so i purchased that um i have the receipt so yeah 27 dollars for the duo which is kind of steep because I didn't even talk about um, the, it's 0.34 fluid ounces. So it's tiny. And the cleanser is 1.7 fluid ounces, tiny. So um, TSA approved for traveling. Um, then the next thing I got was Dermalogica, a daily exfoliant. It's 0.45 fluid ounces and it was $16. Um, I haven't tried it yet. It's a daily micro exfoliant, achieve brighter, smoother skin, which I'm trying to achieve um, every day with this iconic exfoliating powder. Rice based powder activates upon contact with water, releasing papain, salicylic acid, and rice enzymes to polish skin to perfection, gentle enough for daily use. So my skin is okay with sal salicylic acid. My skin flourishes with benzoyl peroxide. That's just what Tia is, but um, yeah, daily exfoliant. I can't wait to try it. Um, I'm going to, I don't like to put all things together like when I'm doing skincare. Um, when I'm testing things out. So right now I'm just going to be using this for the time being. Um, but I'm pretty sure it just, it, it moisturizes my skin, which is a good thing. But I don't know if you've had acne before, I want my skin to not be oily. Like I want it to be, um, moisturized but this is my moisturizer it's aloe gel um, and it's very light and sometimes when your skin is so dry it doesn't work but if you use it right after you get out of the shower or right after you wash your face when your pores are open and your skin is wet it works beautifully for me and it doesn't give acne at all um so yeah there's that and then i have one more thing that i may even try before um or interchange it's uh youth to the people superfood cleanser i hear great things about that uh or about this it's a face wash deep clean pores keeps skin clear removes makeup and spf um it's refillable and reusable um stacked with antioxidants vitamins 
Um, and good for skin super greens. This nutrient dense daily face wash gently yet effectively deep cleans pores, rinses away buildup, and balances pH. No sulfates, no stripping, just clean, soft, glowing skin. One step to amplify. Uh, the rest of your routine. How to use, use at the as the first step in your AM and PM routines, pour into wet hands and massage into face and neck. Add water for extra lather, rinse, lather, rinse, rinse, pat dry and follow with a moisturizer. So they had a, um, this was $12. They had a little set too that I wanted to get. I think it was like everything in miniature size for like, was it a hundred bucks or like, it was something. But yes, yeah. So I'm excited. I got a couple of goodies to try on my skin. My skin is not terrible, but I can tell that it's not the best, like I don't have any active breakouts. Um, but uh, this is at the end of the day and you know, she's greasy, but um, yeah. And so on that day I spent $58.99. I don't think that that's a bad, deal but literally sis bro this is all that i got for 58 dollars so you be you be the judge <laughs> you be the judge um but it's just skincare and um i've never purchased a uh, luxury skincare before ever so this was a first for me um i'm gonna try to see i'm gonna take baby steps with it and use, if they have sample sizes or like travel sizes, try those first instead of investing in the big size and then hating it. Um, but of everything that I tried this, I would at the moment, so this is just a few weeks. I haven't emptied anything. So you get the best idea um, of how I feel about a product in a product empty video. I don't know if you want product empty videos with skincare, um, but it's a video idea. Um, but yeah, I would, uh, as of now, as of like a week or two or three, I would purchase this again, um, the deep cleanse. Like I really like it. It's creamy. It's a little bit of, of exfoliating. It's not like abrasive. Um, even when you use it by itself, it's just very creamy. Um, but this for the price, um, it seems like a little goes a long way, but I just like a lighter, even though it's called water cream, I like a lighter moisturizer, aloe. It's pore perfecting Japanese wild rose for normal to oily skin. Yeah, I mean, in theory, anyway, I don't know. Maybe it takes a while for my face to get used to it, but it's kind of like too moisturizing. Anyway, going on and on. Um, but if you like this content, please be sure to like it, um, click the bell notification, and subscribe. Um, also, I wanna thank you for clicking on this video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. I see my new subscribers. I see you. I see my oldie with goodie subs subscribers. I see you too. So please, please, please be sure to click the like button. Um, share this video if you can. And I will see you tomorrow with another video because the month of December, I'm doing videos every day or a day not sure when it's gonna post but by 12 midnight eastern standard time you will get a post from little old me because just because because i love you i love you and i'm thankful for your support and i've been mia for about a month and I just need to amp it up. So a uh, thank you to you and your support. I'm doing this, challenging myself and
that's it. So thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, share, subscribe, and let me know if you've tried any new skincare. Also, the elephant in the room is my hair looks curly, right? It looks curly, right? So I did a wet braid out. I didn't blow out my hair. Um, today is Thursday. I did that Saturday. So this coming up Saturday, I'm gonna wash my hair. Videos coming about that, but um, yeah, something quick. I did a braid out. I used a mousse and I didn't even like have my hair out. I took the braid out out and then just put it back in a ponytail, use a little bit of edge um, control. I use the Misha mousse and the uh, Ollie's oils edge control and that's it. I might have used up the rest of the um, Misha leave-in with the mousse, but yeah, so that's it and it lasted all week looked the same all week I, I ain't do nothing that's about the easiest kind of out of your face you won't get any frizzies I mean my hair is frizzy a little bit um, but this is it anyway I'm out